Israel HVAC is sponsored by Yellow Jacket, one of the most reliable names in all of HVAC tools, including the new Titan Digital Manifold, the new Omni Digital Vacuum Gauge, the reliable Bullet Two Stage 7 CFM Vacuum Pump, and the new YJ. LTE recovery machine. For more information, visit yellowjacket.com. All right, guys, we're getting ready to do something I've never done before. We're going to change out this drive on this train variable speed. There's the new drive. I've had to disconnect pulled for probably five minutes now because you know you de you have to you have to let all this stuff you know, settle down because this is DC volts before you go touching it. So, uh, anyway, the power's been off. I'm going to give it a few more minutes. It looks pretty simple, but, you know, looks can be deceiving. We'll see how things go. All right, there's what it looks like without the inverter drive. Just a big empty cabinet. There's the old one. Here's the new one. I'm going to set the new one in place. After I get the new one in place, we'll go over some of this stuff and uh, I'll show you how this copper tubing mounts on. It's, it's actually been uh, relatively simple thus far. All right, guys, so it comes with this thermal grease, which we had to put on the liquid line so that it makes connection with the aluminum back there. I'm also going to uh, apply it to the back of this. I don't know if it's completely necessary to do it that way. It doesn't say in the instructions, but I don't think it'll hurt anything. And they said you don't have to use much. So I put some on there, got it on there. This is gonna fasten on there and cover that up. And then we'll get back to y'all. All right guys, the new one's all in. Everything is back in place. Our liquid line's in with the grease. You can see I got grease all over the place. Uh, all the plugs are back in. We even changed out the little monitor here that tell, you know, for your troubleshooting codes and all that that came with it. Uh, they recommend when you do the drive, you do that with it. So we did. Um, I can, I got this little yellow wire here with a plug. That's the only thing I'm having trouble with. I'm about to look at the wiring diagram. Everything is plugged in, but I can't figure out where this thing goes. I should have took a picture, but I mean, I didn't have any trouble with anything else. Everything else is plug and play. It'll only go in one spot. So, uh, and then you only got the one plug down here for your high voltage, but yeah, I'm having a hard time finding where that one went. So I got to figure that out. All right, so according to the wiring diagram, this does not even go to the board. It's supposed to plug into something up here, which you see my finger right there which goes in here through on your side panel, but I don't see anything missing or unplugged. I don't know if somebody has fooled with this. I don't, I don't even remember touching that. So I, I can't find anything missing that's unplugged. We're going, we're going to put power to this thing and see what happens. All right, guys, I did a reboot on the thermostat. It's in delay. This is the 950 thermostat, which I prefer over the 1050. I don't like the new 1050. I mean, I just don't like the display. I think this is a better looking display than the, uh, than the 1050. So we'll, we'll wait for it to come out of delay. It's 91 degrees in this house. And uh, we'll make sure everything runs okay. All right, obviously I did something right because the machine is running. So it's running. I'm going to let it run. 
while I pick up my stuff, I'm gonna box up. You well, know, I'm gonna bag and box the old drive. It should be ramping up here in just a minute because it's 91 degrees in that house. It'll, it'll, it'll take a second. It'll ramp. But obviously, I did something right. So let's let it run while I clean up, and we'll see how she's doing in a few minutes. All right, she's been running about 10 minutes. She's ramped up to 100%. I got my stuff boxed up, ready to go. My little service bag, all packed up. She's running fine. Now that was something different. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see y'all on the next one.